like, you know, what is it, bucket, the grenades, and all the other stuff, and then just hit you right back. But now, MBD, I'm pretty sure he's fought a lot of game watches, and he has a good idea on how to take this matchup. Uh-oh, but seeing windows. All right. Ooh, okay, oh, okay. That okay. Roll, though, windows. was kind of pro. Ooh, ooh okay. Uh, oh, no air. All right. <laughs> Yo, the there window's looking open right now. I mean, I think he's he kind of doing something right now, yo. Ooh, got one bacon. One, one, one bacon. All right, so top three rivals of Aether, probably top three in this game if I really tried. Yeah, you know, that one bacon is because, you know, he doesn't want to waste, you know, his resources, right? Dang, Ooh. that was a small, that was short, I mean. Oh, my oh, good. Oh, the tech chase. Okay. Okay, that was a really good choice right there. I like how he threw that grenade up, doing a little mix-up. Okay. All right, he threw the grenade away, just making sure that he was not able to get the bucket. All right. Yo, okay, there's the chair. No up here is coming out. Pretty shocked about that. But he got oh. the nares though. He oh, so as you can see from his tag, the rivals team wants to make sure that they at least get one stock against these players. There's no way that's what that that's is. That's OD. For. Don't do that. There's <laughs> no way. I, I I he's playing really good right now. He could take more than one stock in yeah. game, right? Especially with Game oh, Watch so versus you, Snake. I thought you were saying there's no way he could take a stock. Oh no, no, no. He can absolutely You're take a stock. Guy. What the heck? What a nice guy. Game Watch versus Snake, absolutely. Look, he might even take the first stock. Maybe. I mean, Okay, he's out here. He's gone fishing. So I don't, know if, I don't know if you know too much about MPD's uh, play style, but he is grenade, grenade heavy. So for oh. him to not be able to take out grenades, knowing that he wants to bucket, it's a really different play style for him. That's why I feel like you'll see MPD just standing around. It's almost like he doesn't know what to really do. I'll be honest. The way that Windows is playing is not exactly like a lot of other gamer watches. So it can be extremely confusing for MPD to fight this style. Yes, you know? this is a weird gamer watch. Yeah, he's like... He just be reversed. All right. Bacon, like he's doing one bacon. That's his approach. And then he actually did an approach of F smash on shield when, like, normally if you see Meister, up smash. he would do up smash and or down, down smash. <laughs> or down tilt, too. Yeah. Or even F tilt. This guy went for the raw uh, F smash. Now, here's the hard part about Snake. Sometimes Snake can get away with a lead. You know, if you don't get that KO, they'll just hide behind grenades and keep letting it explode. But again, you can't take out too many grenades because Game Watch can bucket it. And MPD's being very careful. He's actually respecting Windows a lot right now by not taking out a lot of grenades. Yep, and good stuff. Looking at Windows, who's fishing Ooh. for these KOs, applying aerial pressure, and then putting out a kill move with, like, a okay. chair. Okay. <laughs> Yo, this is scary. Until that was clean. He's like, come over here, come over here. Just walk a little bit further. Was it going to work, though? No up airs? Be reverse? No be reverse. That was tricky. Okay. All right, down throw. So he gets a read. If he had gotten a read, that would have been an up tilt KO at 91%. Oh, we out. There All right, it is. kind of out. Windows almost. Air dodges back towards the stage. Keeps his double jump as well. No up air. All right, okay. hoping for that grenade to explode. Shield down is throw. Getting... Okay. He's... Into. Chill. Ooh, that was clean right there. Just using that short hop. Okay. Oh. And unfortunate for Windows right there. Did not have the bucket out. Ow. Oh, my God. 49. Dude, 49, that was 49. 49%. You always talk about how fair Snake is. Yeah, he's fair, and he did a fair to be able to get that 49%. I mean, that was, yeah. <laughs> Definitely. Oh, don't do that. Ooh. Oh! oh. MVD! <laughs> Yo, leave him alone, man. It's an e. don't Come do on. That. Oh, no. Yeah. JV2 stock coming out from MVD. Fantastic job. He's happy because he took that one stock. He had to attack yeah. one stock. He did. And yep. Yeah, he's bumped, and he's going <laughs> he's to like, the bar. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if he looks old enough, man. Oh, <laughs> that's true. That's true. He's definitely heading away, though. Okay, he's, yeah, go, he's coming back in the circle. He's going to play Rivals. <laughs> that's how amazing that game is. He's going back to practice the game immediately after that. Uh oh, it looks like Lucius is about to come up. This is the player I was talking about. Oh, I was hyped yeah. about this guy. Yeah, man, because he used to play Yoshi. Look at that fursuit, man. Yeah, I love I love the fursuits, man. Of course. I remember you went to Furcon uh, 20, what was it? 20, 2016? 2016. Maybe, that yeah. Was, it was very interesting. That was Genesis 3. Yeah, it was the same weekend as Genesis. I went to the Furcon. They had, like, a party. They, they love me, man. I got, like, 300 followers from the furry community, and I went to their party, and it was very, very, very interesting. Yeah, man, the fact that they, one of the reasons why they love you was because of the fact that you were so accepting of their community. You know, there's a lot of times where people will see something that they're not used to, and immediately they'll hate on it, and they'll be like, I don't know what this is, but I'm going to hate on it without even giving it a chance to understand the community and, you know, what makes them so happy. And once yeah. you realize everybody's on that pursuit of happiness, we shouldn't hate on whatever it is that brings them happiness, because this world can be a dark place for many. So shout out to the fur community. Yo, you turned yeah. that into some crazy thing when I got my boy, you know, looking like fox with rainbow hair. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm just thinking about the happy. Oh, he's looking right at us. Look, look, look. Look, when he turns his head to the right, he's kind of looking, look, look, look. Don't that look scary? <laughs> he's like, what's going on, boys? He looks like a character from Five Nights at Freddy's. <laughs> yeah, kind of. <laughs> a lot of scare, uh, 
I, I could player. not play that game. Oh my goodness. I played a play for subs, dude. No. Sub goal. No. I can't handle scary games. All right, games. guys. If Qatar reaches a thousand subs, all the Five Nights at Freddy's games. Let's go. I'm down for it. <laughs> <laughs> in the dark. <laughs> so I'm wondering if this guy wants to also take one stock. So you said he's Lucius, right? Yeah. Playing as Yoshi. Okay, kind of looks like his um his suit. Let's see what's gonna happen here. <laughs> Yoshi versus Snake. Only able to take off one snake off or uh, one stock off of MBD. Actually surprised that they decided to bring him out instead of letting Kekosaw go in. But I think that's probably because of the fact that they have a lot of faith in Lucius's ability. Lucius definitely can take off more Just than one. He threw up that side beam. Oh, goodness. That was scary. <laughs> that side beam is eventually going to come down. Here we go. All right. They got the countdown, and we're going straight to the races. Look at this. My man is egging like crazy. Yeah, I feel like MVD thinks he can take out the whole team. I feel like I, I know that's what he's going for. He looks like he's try-harding really hard, which is, you know, respectable. I mean, the way I look at it, too, it's, a, it's a tough situation because... If he wins, they're going to be like, well, you know, we play rivals. And if he loses... <laughs> it's know? like, yeah, we play rivals. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Same thing. damned if you do, damned if you don't. Yeah. Dang, that sucks. <laughs> All right, MVD getting a little, having a little bit of trouble getting the hits in. But right now, Lucius, this is looking very similar to, as we saw earlier with Windows. He was able to get a good lead in the beginning, or at least make it even against MVD. But then in the end, only taking one stock. Yeah. Oh, those grenades right now. Now you can use a grenade, so you're going to see MBD take out a grenade at least one per second at this point. Uh-oh. There it is. This time we see way more grenades, like you said, because of the fact that Game of Watch's reflector is not in play now. Clean? Yeah. Okay, threw a grenade outside just for the crowd. You know, the crowd won one. <laughs> he blew them up. Come on, go one right over to me. <laughs> Imagine that, you know, yeah. like, at a baseball game, you want to catch the ball. Yeah. I don't think you want to catch snakes grenade. <laughs> I'm down to catch one of these. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Okay, almost getting that up smash on the grenade, but right now he's at prime percent to get a run up up tilt. Boom. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> run up up tilt. It's weird because Snake, he's running away a lot of the time. So yeah. you think like, oh, he's going to keep running. But then when you when he has you at like 100%, that's when he's like, okay, I'm going to switch it up, run in and get that up tilt. Thank you. He set him off right there. Fourth of July status. 58% right. too. I'm scared. Lucius can't make it happen. Okay. Let's see the setup up here. Oh, okay. Ooh. Usually the down B is the modus operandi. All right. That was a very interesting crawl. Dang. I always feel sad when I hear Yoshi scream like that, dude. I, I don't feel sad. Why? Yoshi's so cute. He's one of my favorite Mario Kart characters. To you? Mario Kart? What? All right. Anyways, here we go. <laughs> KO right now. MVD only losing one stock. And like I said, it feels like he's going to try to take out the whole team. If he could, he should be able to take the stock, to be honest. And if he does take the stock, he'll have one stock against the next person on the team. I mean, even, even if everything's doing really well, the goal of each Rivals player was to actually try to get one stock from each player. So the fact that they're, they're actually doing a pretty good job right now. Yeah, no, fantastic. That up yep. there, one more up there. Okay, let's see if he can end it. The charge up smash might gets, be able to do something. Maybe. That, now there's a lot of damage. Uh oh, MPD, hold up, hold That's up. That's a lot. Where are you going? MPD's not losing the stock, man. Yo, if he does, though. Don't do it, <laughs> MVD. He has to watch out for that down B. He needs to explode it really soon because it's going to explode on itself. Yeah, man. If he needs to get this, man, you know, Thunder Gaming's watching, man. Boom. Oh, and my goodness. Let it go. All right. It's Yoshi, dude. You ready for that run-up up to him? You think it's going to happen? Probably. Ready, set. Yo, he ate what? those. <laughs> Y'all thought they censored you just now. <laughs> Yo, what just happened there? What happened to me? Yo, the up tilt and my voice got nerfed. <laughs> it definitely did. See ya. Off the top. Lucius, though, good job, man. Bringing MVD down to seven stocks. Representing Thunder Gaming right here. Wait, who who else is on Thunder? Dark Wizzy? No, no, no. That's no, MVG. That's MVG. So Yo, I'm getting them mixed up so hard. Don't right worry, now. and that's why we're a team. We look out for each other. Thunder Gaming consists of K9S Bruce, Raito from Japan. Ooh, yo, yo, I'm scared right now. He, saw him put, he pointed at him so hard. And there's uh, Cake Assault giving a high five to Broza Lena, Broza FGC, who is a rep. Uh, he actually does some good commentary too for Rivals of Aether. Here is the number one Cake Assault. He's about to come up on stage, and uh, I don't exactly know the what number one what? Number one Rivals of Aether player. Oh, yes, I've seen this guy play before. He's the big dog. All right, we got a lot of um, yelling going on on the stage right now. MVD pretty pumped, trying to see if he could still get to be able to take out the whole team. Put some respect on my boy Cake Assault's name, man. By the way, guys, before we get into this, man, Rivals of Aether, there's going to be a Switch Definitive Edition release. I'm hyped for that. Which is going to be amazing. Because think about it, for you people out there, 
that always wanted to play Rivals, but maybe you're not a fan of playing games on PC. Like, Me. I'm not the biggest PC gamer. I like playing games on console. The moment Rivals is on Switch, you know how easy it is to just go back and forth and switch between games? Oh, I'm in a mood to play Rivals. All right, you could just hit home on your, you know, Switch Pro Controller, or you just pull out the Switch from the dock and switch games from Ultimate to Rivals or Rivals to Ultimate with super ease. And that also makes it super convenient for the TOs out there. Now TOs, instead of having to lug over all these, you know, like desk, uh, what, what is it? These desktop towers yeah. uh, to have to play Rivals, we're just gonna have a Switch, super portable. You have Switches right there. You can have Switches allocated for Ultimate and for Rivals. And now this will actually be able to help grow the Rivals community exponentially. Yeah, and so, I'm guessing yeah. they can play with the GameCube controllers too. Exactly, yeah. Of course, I mean, of course, because you, I mean, you could do that already with uh, the PC version. I don't know if you know, but you could play, uh, you could connect your GameCube controller adapter to your PC. Did you know that? Oh, it, yeah, that yeah, didn't, I didn't know that. USB. Yeah. Oh, oh, yes, that's true. I didn't know. I, so I'm assuming it's that's totally how they play it then. Yeah, don't worry. But it'll I, be a lot easier if they have like the Switch, because I feel like the Switch is the easiest system to bring around and play, especially exactly. if you just have a dock in a room, you just switch the console dock, and that feels so good compared to like, I'll play the other systems, yeah. and I'm like, yeah, let me carry my big old PS4. And, That's what I'm saying. You know, Easy. Yeah, Easy so it's use. pretty good. So is this the last team of the four teams or nope, of the eight no teams? No, sir. We're, this is our third set. Ooh, fantastic. Can't wait to see some more. There so keep go. in mind, guys, that this is single elimination. Oh, K9 Bruce is on this team. I like to see K9 that. K9S Bruce. Don't forget the S. Hey, hey. All right, MVD versus Cake Assault is about to happen right here. MVD with seven stocks remaining to Cake Assault's three. Cake Assault, the number one rappers of Aether player in oh, the planet. And he's playing as Kirby. And he's playing the worst character in the game. Is that the worst character in the game? A little Mac, maybe, right? Arguable. arguable. Maybe Mac, but Kirby's Kirby, definitely Kirby. one of the worst characters in the game. Even I, don't, I, I don't know. Kirby I got like some buffs, so that forward tilt looking nice. Kirby boy. can do some stuff. There's though. good, too. I seen Komoda. Komoda was facing off against was uh -oh. it Nakat? Uh oh yeah, he that took the game. Good, yeah, that was a good battle. Yo, and Komoda's always doing something in Frostbite. Facts. You remember last year with Void? That was yeah. nice. Down throw? Oh, oh my A-Town Storm! Oh my god! Yo, he said do the A-Town Storm. Yo, he's really going for this three stop. Yeah, he is, man. Don't do it to him. Up tilt, up tilt? No. But that was a lot of damage right there, however. Uh -oh, a lot the of the, the Rivals players are having trouble noticing where the C4 is. <laughs> Yeah, oh man. Goodness, neutral air. Dang, no coaching. Maybe <laughs> <laughs> he can't hear me. Raps. He's cooking. There you All go, right, kick off. He is cooking the grenades right now. See if he can get the landing. Oh. He does. Back throw? No. He had, a, he had an earlier back oh. air opportunity. God. All right, MVD with these forward oh, no. airs. I'm here for it, dude. Oh my god, he almost stuck, he almost stuck him. Yeah. Oh, that's what he tried. Yes. He did forward air to try to stick because it doesn't send. Oh. Stole that from Anti, just kidding. MVD, really good tech chase with that single hit neutral air right there. I love it. Yo, what's going on? <laughs> what is. Oh, okay, that would have been a really nice setup. He would have gotten a down B and gotten a fair to connect as a combo. Ooh. Okay, oh, okay. MVD! Okay, yo, Throw this, grenade. Is, this is his showcase right oh, back here. Back here? Ladies and gentlemen, if you wanted an MVD highlight reel, <laughs> here you have it, man. All right, Team Rival struggling a little bit, but they can still be able to bring this back. All, oh, dang. I mean, all Cake Assault has to do is take one stock. Remember, each player took one stock. Cake Assault, it's on you now to see if you can fill the quota. I don't know if I believe. Fill the quota. Ooh. Back here, up here, he's no. dead. And there it is, ladies and gentlemen, MVD does it with all seven stocks. Shout out to the Rivals of Aether team, and we hear a, 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 a correct characteristic booze from the crowd. Yeah, what is going I, on I, feel like, I feel like it's a troll, because it's like, how dare you do yep. that to them? You took them all out with one player.